This is a 1955 Ford Crown Victoria. And you can see there the overhead valve V8, Y block, oil filter there, engine manifold, very nice. Blower for the uh, air condition for the heater rather. No air conditioning on this. And it's got a six volt battery here. The year before they made the change to twelve volt. Beautiful red and white combination. Nice use of stainless trim here to demark the two color zones here. Very nicely done. Real flare for color. And here, of course, is the chrome piece going over the top of the car. The crown part of the Crown Victoria. Inside, you have similar arrangement here. The interior is very colorful in red and white. This has a car as formatic. And there are three dials there on the dash. One on the right is the clock, one in the middle is the radio, and the one on the left is the heating ventilating control. The speedometer is open in the front to allow light to pass through to eliminate the uh, numbers. An unusual design that was done in 54 and 55 from Fords. Fender skirts. Radio antenna here on the back. Well, that was a common practice back in the day. And you can see on the trunk lid Ford Automatic and Fairlane also. I like to get in a little advertising in the back of the car. <coughs> there are the reverse lights above the tail light. Inside here you can see the the uh, continuation of the uh, red and white color scheme notice the dog leg there with the wrap around windshield that's the part there that allowed the light through to the speedometer so you could see There you can also see the segments there for the Fordomatic there on the dial indicator on top of the steering column. Just beautiful car. Very well restored.